We've seen it before. Young kids out joyriding. Debris still lines the stretch of Lake George Road after the high speed crash. Matt Campbell was awake and heard the car fly by his house. I didn't see any lights. I just heard speed on this road, like intense speed. Soon after, a teenage girl, a passenger in the car, frantically knocked on the Campbell's front door. It was like, I'm 14, he's 14, um, my, bro my, my brother's 15. And that, you know, what we were doing was out, you know, joy, joy riding the car. The car wound up at the intersection of Lake George and Ray Roads after first running off the road into this embankment. Now you've got one wheel up, both wheels are up at this point. You know, we can see at this point, you know, even, even up into there, we're seeing tracks. And now here's where the, here's where the, you know, the roll or whatever's happening. In fact, Oakland County Sheriff's investigators say the vehicle rolled several times. The 14-year-old boy was found in the ditch after being thrown from the vehicle. The driver had to be cut out of the wrecked car. The engine was ripped right out of the Ford Focus and was in the middle of the road. As for the speed? She said 100 miles an hour. Now, we, a lot of us know needles bury at 80. So who's to say? But we know the needle was buried. The three teens were all taken to Pontiac Osteopathic Hospital. Police say they are in stable condition tonight. In Addison Township, Dave Llewellyn, Channel 7 Action News. Police tell us that vehicle was taken without permission from the mother of one of those teenage victims.